Toronto police say they killed a gunman near three schools. According to the Special Investigations Unit in Ontario, Canada, police responded to allegations of a man with a handgun and, there was an encounter between the cops and the individual. The guy was shot at least once by two cops at some time during the encounter, according to authorities. At the scene, the suspect was declared deceased. Officials were attempting to ascertain the scope of the danger by placing many nearby schools on lockdown, as shown by a series of tweets from Toronto's school board. After two mass shootings in the United States in less than a year, this latest atrocity comes at a time when Americans are trying to come to terms with their shock. In light of recent events in the United States, Toronto Police Chief James Raymer noted during a press conference that, we absolutely appreciate the pain and how horrific this must have been for staff, children, and parents. It is understandable that the neighborhood is concerned, given the armed suspect was within a few hundred feet of a number of elementary schools. William G. Davis Jr. Public School, Joseph Howe Sr., Charlottetown, Sir Oliver Mowat Collegiate Institute were among the schools placed on lockdown in a tweet from the school board's communications department. One kid told CNN affiliate CTV, I was so afraid, so I simply began praying. A press statement from Ontario's Special Investigations Unit states that they are currently investigating the deadly gunshot. It said that four detectives and three experts in the field were assigned to the investigation. To praise police and emergency personnel for the quick response, Ontario Premier Doug Ford tweeted. In a statement, he thanked the Scarborough police and first responders for their fast actions on Tuesday.